In 1963, the United States Air Force set out on a mission. A mission to find a powerful successor to the aging turboprop-driven C-133 Cargo Master. The clock was ticking as the C-133 was nearing the end of its operational life. So, have you ever wondered how an aircraft weighing more than 800,000 pounds can stay airborne indefinitely? What secrets lie behind its impressive cargo hold and technological features? Join us as we unravel the secrets, explore the engineering marvels, and showcase the sheer power of these giants in the captivating world of heavy airlift. In their quest, the Air Force explored the vast realm of aviation, evaluating numerous designs for large logistic transport. And then, like a beacon of innovation, the C-5A Galaxy prototype began to take shape in August 1966. It was a crucial moment, a turning point in military aviation that would shape the future of cargo transport. Fast forward to March 2, 1968, a date etched in aviation history. The C-5 Galaxy, with the designation number 6683 made its grand debut. But before we continue, don't forget to hit that like button if you're enjoying this journey through aviation history. And if you want more fascinating stories like this, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Now, let's dive into what makes the C-5 Galaxy truly extraordinary. This heavy lifter is not your ordinary cargo transport. Its design revolutionized the game, giving it unparalleled capabilities. The C-5 has been the go-to for carrying space containers, modified missions, satellites, and hefty cargo, including heavy helicopters. And here's the cherry on top, the C-5M. The latest evolution of this beast has solidified its reputation as the heavy lifter of the skies. With its expansive cargo compartment, Featuring an upward hanging visor at the nose and large clamshell doors, the C-5 Galaxy continues to be a force to be reckoned with. Moreover, the internal winches and a roller conveyor system work together in harmony, transforming the loading process seamlessly and efficiently. But the real star here is the cargo floor of the C-5, stretching an impressive 121 feet. To put that into perspective, it's a foot longer than the Wright brothers' first flight, and believe it or not, it boasts a whopping 35,000 cubic feet of space, pressurized and climate controlled to cater to diverse operational needs. Now let's talk about the numbers. The C-5 Galaxy's cargo capacity is four times that of its sibling, the C-141A Star Lifter. And when it comes to takeoff, the C-5 Galaxy is nothing short of extraordinary. Thanks to its advanced engineering, featuring commercial engines, long swept wings, and that distinctive TAA tail design, it's a true giant in the skies. The C-5 Galaxy is powered by four General Electric TF-39 GE-1C turbofan engines, each unleashing a formidable 41,000 pounds of thrust. These engines aren't just powerful, they're impressively large, propelling the C-5 into the realm of aerodynamic excellence. The C-5's tail increases the effectiveness of the vertical tail through an end plate effect ensuring that this colossal aircraft slices through the air with unparalleled grace. The horizontal stabilizer, functioning much like a winglet, not only reduces the induced drag of the rudder but also adds a touch of efficiency to its flight profile. It's like the icing on the cake, making the C-5 soar through the skies with grace. Beyond its impressive engines and sleek aerodynamic design, the C-5 Galaxy has some hidden tricks up its massive wings. With a staggering length of 222 feet and 9 inches and a jaw-dropping maximum takeoff weight of 840,000 pounds, this behemoth stands as proof of engineering marvels and military aviation skills. Now, let's talk about a unique feature, the innovative use of reverse thrust. This isn't just for show. It plays a crucial role in efficient braking during landing and even allows the C-5 to maneuver backward on the ground. A rare and impressive capability for an aircraft of this size. And let's not forget the landing gear system, a feat of engineering in itself. Imagine a combination of a single nose strut, four main bogies, and a grand total of 28 wheels. This intricate system is designed for high flotation capability, making the C-5 a true heavyweight champion. The landing gear is equipped with an offset swiveling capability of 20 degrees to each side and a freewheel to facilitate smooth ground movement, which is essential for managing those challenging crosswind landings. What's more, 
The landing gear can be individually raised, simplifying tire changes and brake maintenance. And this colossal aircraft can take off or land in almost any location worldwide, elevating its logistical flexibility to unparalleled heights. But here's where it gets even more fascinating. The C-5's landing gear comes equipped with a three-position kneeling system. This unique feature allows the cargo floor to be lowered to truck bed height. Why does this matter? Well, it makes loading oversized or long wheelbase equipment a breeze by reducing the ramp angle in critical areas. But the C5 Galaxy's technological prowess doesn't stop at its physical design. It extends to advanced systems for monitoring and navigation. Meet the Malfunction Detection Analysis and Recording System, or MADAR for short. This sophisticated automatic troubleshooting system keeps a watchful eye on over 800 test points across the aircraft's various subsystems, ensuring operational integrity. Now let's talk navigation and communication. The C5 Galaxy is decked out with state-of-the-art avionics, including the INS, the Inertial Navigation System. This triple INS setup enhances its self-sufficiency and operational independence. The C5 can perform effectively without relying on ground-based navigational aids, making it a true master of the skies. And the C5 Galaxy showcases an impressive short takeoff and landing skills, even when fully loaded, this aircraft, defying expectations for its size, requires only 8,300 feet for takeoff and a mere 4,900 feet for landing. Now, that's agility at its finest, proving that the C5 Galaxy is not just a heavyweight. It's a heavyweight with a flare. When this mighty aircraft is at its maximum weight of 840,000 pounds, it holds a remarkable capability it can theoretically stay airborne indefinitely. The only limit? The endurance of the crew on board. This strategic game changer means the C5 can cover vast distances without the need to land for refueling. Now, let's address crew fatigue. To tackle this challenge, long flights often involve relief crews, ensuring continuous and efficient operation. It's like a well-choreographed process in the skies, allowing the C5 Galaxy to perform its logistical work without missing a beat. But here's what truly cements the C5 Galaxy's status as a logistical powerhouse, its combination of features. From short takeoff and landing distances to the capacity for aerial refueling, this aircraft is in a league of its own. It can deliver cargo and support across the globe without the constraints of traditional refueling stops. Now let's introduce the C5 Galaxy's notable counterpart, the Antonov A124 Ruslan. Imagine them as siblings in the realm of large strategic airlift aircraft. The A124 shares several external features with the C5, such as a rear cargo door and a similar layout of flight control surfaces. However, it has its own unique twists. The A124 distinguishes itself with a shorter fuselage and a greater wingspan, allowing it to carry a larger payload than the C5. But the real standout feature is its conventional empennage, in contrast to the C5's distinctive T, i.e. -e, a tail, the A124 employs a hybrid fly-by-wire control system, combining electronic and mechanical controls for enhanced redundancy and reliability. Now, meet the Super Guppy, a unique aircraft born from the fuselage of a C-97J Turbo Stratocruiser, the military cousin of the 1950s Boeing 377 Stratocruiser. This aircraft flaunts an extended fuselage, stretching an impressive 141 feet and boasting an enlarged diameter of 25 feet. But the real standout feature is its conventional empennage in contrast to the C5's distinctive TAA tail. The cargo compartment itself measures a substantial 94 feet and 6 inches in length, showcasing a remarkable adaptation of an existing design to meet specific cargo transportation needs. It's proof of the diversity and innovation in aircraft design for specialized purposes. Next up is the Airbus A300-600ST, affectionately known as the Beluga. This aircraft, initially named the Super Transporter, earned its nickname due to its striking resemblance to the Beluga Whale. Designed as a wide-body airliner, the Beluga takes specialized transport to new heights, primarily focusing on moving aircraft parts and oversized cargo. But there's a newer and bigger sibling on the block, the Beluga 44, outshining its predecessor in cargo space and operational range. The Beluga 44 can carry a staggering load of 111,333 pounds inside its 78,000 cubic feet cargo hold and boasts an impressive range of 2,600 miles. 
it's abundantly clear that each of these models represents the pinnacle of aviation engineering. From the iconic C5 Galaxy and Antonov B, A120 for Ruslan to the unique Super Guppy and the impressive Beluga XL, these aircraft showcase the boundless innovation and versatility in the realm of heavy airlift capabilities.